Hi everyone, it's Raziel Kane. I'm back with another toy review. Uh, today, a figure that I had no intention of getting um, because of the price point for a deluxe figure at the price of a leader, I guess. So I'm presenting to you my time traveling friend Gigawatt. Gigawatt? Gigawatt? Gigawatt. Um, so let's get started. I hope you enjoy. For those who like boxes, like my cat, I'm kidding. I don't have a cat. Sorry about the glare again. I'm not a lighting expert, but I think, yeah, there you go. Um, I like this. I mean, it's original. It's uh, you know a time traveling sideswipe. It says uh, Back to the Future here. It says Back to the Future here, but out of time here. Please put it in the comment which one's the real one, or was it? They used both in the movies. I don't feel like rewatching the whole trilogy right now. So I'm going to open this up and take a look at it. I already pegged in the lightning catcher because that's one of the display option. But uh, let's take a quick look at the accessories. The gun looks pretty unique. I don't think I've seen this mold before, but I'm a recent collector, so I may be wrong. Please let me know in the comment that I'm wrong. You have a very tiny Mr. Fusion I'm trying to get it to properly on camera but it is written mr. fusion that's a piece that I will easily lose because on my copy it just sits there so I hope that's just my copy the car itself looks perfect the details are amazing all that electronics and wiring and the sauce I mean you have the detail the out of time here uh, so, in reference to the box earlier, I guess this out of time is the actual license plate and not Back to the Future. I like, it doesn't show, well, maybe it does show a little bit on camera. I like the fact that it looks like some brushed steel. Uh, it's really, really, really nice. The doors will open because of transformation. That's really nice, but then you get to see the arm and the hand sticking out. And you can have two display modes. From the original movie or you can have the flying version i love how they did this here oh here's the face i think it, i should twist it but it's basically on a double joint so when you want a, the car mode just flip it like this but if you want on trend during the transformation you're going to want to flip this more and then flip this inside so i think that's really nice like you could display it like this but then the wheels don't stick out, so that it's not proper. For transformation, it's going to be a little different because you came in alt mode, so you're going to take it. You're going to open the wings. And there you go. Transformation complete. Uh, I love the detail on that chest. The flux capacitor is nice, but the addition of the dates, that's really, really, really cool. I wonder if he looks more like Marty or Doc Brown, or who would voice him? Would it be, would it be more the voice of Doc Brown or Marty? Uh, I'm gonna say Doc Brown. Let me just add the accessory. We'll take a look at it. So there you go, robot mode in uh, complete form with all the uh, weapons attached. Um, this is nice. It pegs a little better with the Mister Fusion. But the problem is that it prevents the hand from holding the gun properly. Or maybe I'm doing it wrong. Again, please let me know in the comment that I'm wrong. The other accessory, the lightning catching rod, it's just there. Maybe it's supposed to be a hook, captain hook thing. I don't know. I don't think it's that necessary to, to be there, but it's a place to not lose it. Great retool of the sideswipe mold. The legs, they transform the same, but there's just so much more details and you have all the details that transfer from the vehicle mode. The doors don't make him more back heavy, so my figure is very, very stable, so I like that. Paint application is somewhat minimal overall. It's really concentrated on a couple areas. The details are really, truly amazing. I'm glad I've picked this up for 42 bucks. I'm not going to show you uh, all the articulations other than what I've already shown with the wheels because it's the same mold as Swipe Swipe and Red Alert and all the others. This is my fifth of this mold, I guess. I have Sideswipe, Red Alert, Tiger Tracks, and Deep Cover. 
Well, there you go, final figure. Really, really, really happy I picked this up. Gigawatt is a great figure. And uh, hopefully you can still get yours at Toys R Us or in the US, I think it was a Walmart exclusive. So I hope you've enjoyed this review. If you did, please like, subscribe and hit the bell. Also leave a comment, I really like reading you guys. And remember, nothing in life gives you the right to be an asshole. Take care.